What's going on guys, Blizzard Unboxing here, coming with a brand new video and in this video I'm going to give you guys unboxing, taste test and full review on the hydration bottles and fan punch G Fuel hydration bottles. Before we get started, please drop a like, subscribe down below, turn on post notifications to all so I do know when I, get, when I upload a video. At the end of the video, um, comment down below, um, let me know how I did, if you had these four or your opinions on these, or if you're getting any other G Fuel, or anything like that, in the comment section. Here they are, I already opened them up and everything. They're right here in the box. I just opened them up so I can take them out and put them in the freezer uh, or in the fridge. Um, so they're cold. For some reason, I'm all the way in Florida and I believe they come from like New York somewhere, like some, uh, from uh, Amazon in New York, um, I'm, I think. But then also whenever I checked on that on my on like my confirmation order, I said it was coming from somewhere in Georgia. So I'm not sure where these came from, but I know that G Fuel originally had them. Okay, so let's just get right into it. Um, okay, so right here you can see a little sticker, but you can see like a side view of them. Um, caffeine free, zero sugar, zero calories. Um, and then um, hydration and electrolytes and vitamins. So hydration bottles and tubs have everything that G Fuel has in the regular tub form. It's just it is no caffeine. It has everything else. And then, but but another added thing which is the electrolytes. So let's open this up. It looks, it, it's like a, it's not crazy or too much effort into design, I don't know. Like, I'm not trying to say that as, as like a diss or like a bad thing. I'm just saying like, it's not too much, there's nothing too, there's not, there's not too much workspace and they made it count and they made it look freaking amazing. Um, but wow, look at the, look at the color of it. Oh, it look, almost looks like a pineapple or soda or something. But anyway, let's just go a little 360. You can see um, Nick Merckx or Faze Nick Merckx um, standing there um, wearing a red shirt, shorts, and an M-Fam on his shirt. Pretty looking like tough guy, eh? Um, and this is his G Fuel flavor. First, they came out with the Sam's Club exclusive um, G Fuel cans and Fat and Punch cans. Now they came out with the sparkling hydration, and now and they recently also released the tub version of the hydration. So I don't doubt that he might get a flavor soon. Anyways, and this is the front. It says G Fuel up and down, zero calories, and on top it says caffeine free, focus plus vitamins plus antioxidants, and you can see G Fuel sparkling hydration. Pretty cool. Those who want that want to read the facts, go for it. I think you should be able to see it. If not, you can always go on the G Fuel website. Anyway, let's open it up, give it a smell test, taste test, talk a little bit about it, what I think about it, um, and rate it. Obviously, let's do it. Okay, I just opened it, and it's already can smell something strong, like something strong, maybe like a pineapple, maybe. And I'll smell it. Like the video, everyone. Let's go. Alright, definitely a, a pineapple forward smell. Um, in other words, a very strong pineapple smell right away. You barely smell anything else. Um, now, I looked at the hydration tub for this and under it said it's supposed to be the orange pineapple strawberry um, tropical punch kind of thing. Um, so I don't know, kind of confused a little bit. Because I'm really only getting a strong pineapple and the lightest bit of orange. Let's give it a taste. This is the MFAM Punch G Fuel Sparkling Hydration. They actually are busted. Okay. Okay. Blizzard Unboxing already confirmed this shit. This is not shit, but it's too, it's beyond my expectations. That's how good it is.
Okay. It literally tastes like a very, like a perfectly, um, ripe, um, pineapple. Like a perfectly ripe, juicy, sweet pineapple. Like if you cut into it near the middle, you take a bite out of it. You know, it's like very sweet, um, sweet, chewy kind of texture. Tastes sweet too. It still really tastes exactly like a pineapple. Even though it's supposed to be like an orange pineapple strawberry. I'm just getting pineapple from it. It's pretty good though, I'm not gonna lie. Very, 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 very outstanding. Very good tasting. Wow. Like, sometimes I don't know how to like word stuff like this. Like, if I, like, I don't know how to word stuff like that. I just go on and on and on about the same stuff over over again. So if you want to help me with that, please tell me different ways to describe G Fuel. I don't know, but this right here, Ampam Punch G Fuel, very, very good. I don't know who might, like, I don't think anybody would dislike these. And if they do, you got that checked out. Okay, now let's talk a tiny bit more about it so we don't go, we don't go on a rant. Let's try keeping this talk under a minute and 30 seconds so I don't start ranting about how good this is. It's not like this. So, Ampham Punch G Fuel Sparkling Hydration. Is it good? It's more than good. Um, will I recommend it to you guys? Yes, I would, definitely. Um, they dropped the whole hydration bottle line. They first started off with the black cherry um and kiwi strawberry inspired by bad batch star wars um those sold out but they're working on fixing up the ingredients on the kiwi strawberry hydration bottles but the black cherry ones are still available um it's just now they're all on amazon exclusive so you can only get them on amazon you can, you can get this on amazon and if you do end up picking this up um let me know in, in the comment section or let me know on Twitter, which is also in the description to so follow all my socials. Um, so that's that. Um, now, as far as what I'm tasting out of this, I would say um, the prominent flavor or the one that hits you right away and that stays throughout is definitely pineapple. And then the two other flavors, the orange and strawberry, are very mellow, very low light. You can barely taste them, and if you do, you taste them for a split second. Um, it's not a bad thing. Maybe they could improve on that, make 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 it more like that. Um, who knows? But I Loki kind of like it like this. Okay. Um, definitely, you should pick, this is definitely easy call for you guys. You guys should definitely pick this up without a doubt. Now I'm gonna give another taste for the rating and wrap this review up. So before I do please drop a like on this video it really helps me out a lot a lot let's try getting 15 likes let's go for the final taste test and ranking no i'm telling you i'm telling you you should buy this i'm telling you and chief you Gamma Labs, especially, and G Fuel, and Nick Merckx. Like, give yourself a million pat on the back. Like, after you watch my video, Nick, Nick Merckx, G Fuel, Gamma Labs, if you're watching this, go through a little party at your house. Like, you guys, like, this is, like, phenomenal. And also invite me to that party. But, wow. I'm really like chugging this. I'm like addicted to how good it is. Anyways, my final review is I, I think you guys should know. It's a very, very simple 9.5 out of 10, guys. So, Nick Merck's um, M Pound Punch Hydration Bottles 9.5 out of 10. Why not a 10? Because I've been noticing and I just don't think I should keep like being a little too biased because like cause I, know, I learned my lesson from this 
Uh, and, I'm, and I'm not saying it's for all Jesus players, only for a couple that whenever I first try them, they generally are very, very good, mind-blowing, all that stuff, whatever. But once you start having them more, you realize they're not as good as you rank them in your initial review. Therefore, I'm giving a 9.5, even though it's only 0.5 with 10, only because it's barely in, I can barely taste strawberry and orange. So yeah, 9.5 out of 10. Make sure you guys please drop a like. Please subscribe to my channel, turn on notifications. Comment down below what you thought. Other than that, Blizzard Boxing, and I'm out.